Everybody, it's Smiley. Hey. Okay, we're going to start your mock yeah. test. When you're ready and it's safe, actually, jump in the gun. We need to do your tell me question. All right. Would you tell me, how would you test to see if your brake lights were on? Uh, okay, if you turn on the um, the engine, uh, when you press down the uh, brake light, when you uh, press the brake pedal, um, there's always a reflection. Nice, good light. answer. I like yeah. the reflection answer. Okay, yeah. we're going to get started. So I'm just going to ask you to drive on when it's safe yeah. and take the next road on the right. All right. Good luck. Thank you. Ignore what I'm about to say. Just take your time to drive on. If anyone's here for the results, they will all be done at the end. So if you're here for the results, just skip to the end. And we'll see you there. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and all that good stuff. Nice double blind spot check. I think I might have to beep that bit out. Yeah. <laughs> That's the first time I've ever heard you swear. It was oh, really? very quiet. Okay. I don't think the microphone will quite pick that up, to be honest. But I definitely heard it. Did you hear it? I did. I must I admit. Say, I say the sugar. You're going to have to say your Hail Marys later. Okay, would you take this next road on the right for me, please? Thank you. Just, oh, yeah, sorry. Yeah, it's a little sneaky one, yes, isn't it? yeah. This is where the learner vehicle yeah, went. Yeah, went, yeah. I love the leaves. Yeah. They are going to fade away now. Probably not going to have any space on this road to pull over, to be fair. Actually, maybe just behind this black car. Yeah. Don't worry about the driveway. Just do your best to stop somewhere behind the black car. It doesn't oh, have okay. to be perfect. This would be fine, to be yeah. fair. All right, thank you very much. Yeah. Right, um, if you just temporarily secure the vehicle, we're going to get started the, with the independent drive. Okay, so everyone that's taken a real driving test, uh, usually this starts at the beginning. 80% chance you'll be using the sat-nav. Uh, now we're going to start the sat nav, and I'd just like you to drive on when you're ready. Okay. Um, if you're not too sure of the direction, just ask your examiner or ask me. We'll do our best to help you if it's safe. Otherwise, just follow the directions from the sat nav. Okay. And uh, yeah, when you're ready, just follow the road ahead. You will arrive follow at your sat-nav. destination at 12.02 p.m. Excellent, again on that double blind spot check. And nice signal. At the end of the road, turn left, A404 Duxbridge Road. Turn left. Very nice observations. Some of these junctions are very difficult to see. After 200 yards, cross the roundabout and take the first exit, A410, Duxbridge Road. Another thing that's very difficult to see. Cross the roundabout and take the first exit.
I like those frequent mirror checks. It's nice to see. Very good for awareness. Yeah. All those motorbikes, bicycles. Yeah. They will just come suddenly. We've got the electric ones now. Quite fast. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, didn't you have an electric bicycle? Uh, no, I've got an electric bike. Oh, you do? No, yeah. yeah. They can go quite fast, right? Oh, yes. Yeah. They can even overtake you if you yes. have Funny you say that. That happened to yeah. me yesterday. Yeah, they overtook you. Yeah. Yeah. But don't worry, I overtook them afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> I feel good when I overtake a car. On the bicycle? Yes. Yeah, it's funny, isn't it? Yeah. Nice mirror checks again. Long time we've come this road. It's you good remember? Though, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Practice. On our thirsty days. So compared to those memories, yeah. how does it feel now? After now, 300 yards, uh, I, I feel like I'm driving alone. You are not around. So you're in a comfort zone? I'm in a comfort zone. More comfort zone. I didn't hear what you said. Oh, now. So it would be straight ahead. Yeah, second okay. exit. Cross the roundabout and take the second exit. That's still the signal there at the end. After 300 yards, cross the roundabout and take the second exit, A410, Duxbridge Road. Cross the roundabout and take the second exit. timing on your signal. Next roundabout, third exit, turning right. After 200 yards, go right on the roundabout and take the third exit, Courtney Avenue. Go right on the roundabout and take the third exit. Take the exit, Courtney Avenue. That was fun. Hey. <laughs> hey, I knew you were enjoying it. Oh yeah. my god. Am I on the up. right foot? Okay, I was confused. I thought I did like the other girl. Uh, I thought I did like the other girl who went on the... Um...
After 200 yards, go right on the roundabout and take the third exit, Long Elms. Then take the second left. Go right on the roundabout and take the third exit. Then take the second left. After 200 yards, turn left, Headstone Lane. Turn left. Narrow roads. I think you know this road. Yes. That's nice because then we can be prepared, right? We're prepared. There, where you don't know, you don't know. After 200 yards, then it will turn it will right. Melbourne by surprise, when you go. Yes. Yeah. Especially. Yeah. Turn right. And then just taking the next road on the right. After 200 yards, turn left, Greystoke Avenue.
So the sat nav slightly giving us the wrong information. Yeah. We're just going to follow the road, so oh, we won't okay. need to signal here. Turn left, okay. just Greystone the Avenue. Okay. Nice mirrors again. See, checking them every now and again. It's a really nice habit. Safe driving. They're the most important. Yes, so you know the direction. Brilliant. Uh, shortly after, we've got the U turn. So I don't think we really need to go over it too much. Uh, we'll just go straight into doing the actual junction itself. Yeah. Yeah. Lovely. Nice work for me. At the end of the road, turn right, George the Fifth Avenue, then sharp left, A404. Turn right, then sharp Correct. left. Yes. We're still here. Come on, this time, this time, feeling lucky. Sharp left, A404, George V Avenue, then make a U turn. Correct. After 100 yards, make a U turn. Make a U turn. When it's safe, I'd like you to show us how you would open and close your side window. My side window? Yes, please. Okay, thank you very much. And we'll just continue to follow the sat nav. We've got the manoeuvre to do, and we're finished. Not too long now. After 300 yards, go left on the roundabout and take the first exit, A404 Duxbridge Road. Go left on the roundabout and take the first exit.
Spread? Yes, please. Yeah, so the sat nav won't really give us the best direction anymore. So, what we'll do is we'll just say that's the end of the independent driving. Okay. The sat nav would say on your real test you've reached your destination. The examiner will then tell us to just continue to follow the road ahead. So, no need to stop, just continue to follow the road ahead. And the examiner will give you the direc directions for the rest of the test. Okay? okay? And that's what I'll do. Okay. Just going to follow the road ahead at the traffic lights. Okay. Shortly after the traffic lights, there'll be two roundabouts. Okay. Sometimes the examiners ask us to follow the signs. It's a bit hard to see because of the yeah, parked vehicles. vehicles. So just past the parked vehicles, you'll have your two roundabouts. Oh, okay. Twin roundabouts. Yeah. At the first twin, mm -hmm. go straight. Okay. And at the second twin, uh -huh. turn left. Okay. Nice acceleration. Good mirror checks as well. Do you remember the directions? Ah. Okay, never mind. Just follow the road ahead. And I'll give you the directions again. Almost back to test center, we'll finish off with the maneuver. At the roundabout, uh -huh. like to take the first exit, nothing too tough. Turning left.
again with those lovely mirror jacks. Okay, just at the Esso slash Tesco petrol station. Turn left, it's the next road on the left. That takes us back to the test center. Tunnel. Yeah. What do you call it? A meeting for? Yes, meeting, yeah. So we might have a meeting situation happening in this bend as well. Yeah. Excellent positioning. Good speed. Nice anticipation. Well done. That was really good. It's a racy, it's a racy. OMG, <laughs> we must crown you queen of the road. <laughs> you made the BMW stop. <laughs> <laughs> I scared me. Let me just uh, pinch myself, see if mm. I'm dreaming. <laughs> I scared them. Yeah. Mm. I like it. Ah. Okay, so we're almost back. Um, that slightly distracted me from the manoeuvre, but you know what? Yeah. You see this uh, colour car, bluey, greeny? Yes. Would you just come alongside it, side by side? And if you just stop parallel with this vehicle, just here, a little closer. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's lovely. Thank you. And then what I'll ask you to do next, mm -hmm. surprise, surprise. Surprise. Is to reverse park. Cool. Take your time, don't worry too much about the yellow line or the driveway. So if you okay. stop a little bit on the yellow line or the driveway, that's okay for the manoeuvre, okay? Yeah. okay. Examiners will mention that as well. Uh, okay. All right, take your time, absolutely no rush. And when it's safe, we'll, uh, we'll start the manoeuvre. You know what I think a better vehicle might be? Yeah. Possibly the black one in front, but you know what? They're going around us now. In so, front? Yeah, okay. it's all right. We'll just continue with the manoeuvre here. Oh, okay. Okay, so take your time when you're ready, we'll begin. Good job for stopping for the vehicle here. Observations are good as well. Yeah, this is nice.
Just gonna set that right blind spot check, you picked up on the clue. Try to get that right blind spot check before you start to reverse. Left was very good. Just yeah. gonna get the left and right. Yeah. And then we reverse, okay. Mm -hmm. I'd love to know what you're thinking right now. It's okay. 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 Is that what you're thinking? One more time. From the beginning? No. No. It's all right. I've parked. Okay. Should we secure the vehicle? If we're finished? Maybe a better question is, are we finished? <laughs> the, yes. Yeah. All right. Let's secure the vehicle. We just put it into park and apply the handbrake for me, just because yes, we're on a we bit. Yes, we need them. Yeah. Just a handbrake. Let's pull it up to the sky. There we go. Just secures us a little bit more because we're on a bit of a hill. Okay. Yeah. All right. Relax. Do me a extra favor, Flav, mm -hmm. and push the power button. We'll power down. We'll know it's the end of our mock driving test slash real driving test when the examiner asks us to switch off the engine. Okay? Yeah. Now, as we all know, it is a tradition around here to ask, how do you feel it went? Yeah, it went all right. Pass or Pass. fail? Pass. Pass? Mm -hmm. Okay, judge jury and examiners cast a verdict or if someone could start the poll. Um, brilliant. So, there are a few marks. Let's go over the minors before we get results in from chat. Mm -hmm. uh, the manoeuvre, let's start with that. Yeah. Okay, so, all right, not too bad. Let me just check the back tyre. Mm, okay, we'll give it to you. The back tyre is a little bit further away than the front tyre, mm -hmm. but I'd say it's not too bad. Yeah? yeah? It's about a steering wheel away. 
We wouldn't want it to be more than that because mm. it could obstruct the traffic. Yeah. Okay. Um, the observations as well were very good on the maneuver, but we do want to just have another look all the way around before reversing or before moving forward. So if you need to do the correction, you know you're allowed to do that. Absolutely fine. We're allowed three to four minutes to complete the exercise. Okay. Yeah. All right. So there you go. That's the maneuver, but we've got two minors on that. Um, the show me, tell me questions weren't too bad. However, do you remember the show me question? Yeah. Open and close Open the window. Open and close the window, yeah. How was the control of the vehicle when we were doing that? Okay, it was, was a big E. Do you remember? Oh. I don't know, because I didn't remember anything on my mock tests. So I was like just listening to the uh, driving instructor tell me this happened, that happened, and my memory was like I that. shake a bit. Yeah, a little, yeah. yeah. So there was a little loss of control there. We started to yeah. drift over to the right. You did the open, and then when we did the close, we drifted back over to the left, mm -hmm. trying to keep in between the lines, just hold the lane discipline there. So another minor there, so three in total, while we're waiting for the pole to come in. Uh, we've got another minor for mirror checks, change of directions. Actually, probably more of a major, but let's just call it a minor. You know the double roundabouts at the end? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah but... All right. Um, yeah. If chat could see the facial expressions right now, okay, <laughs> tell me more. What happened? The second one. Well, we had two, didn't one? we? Yeah. yeah. So twin one, twin two, and the directions. And oh, right. Just describe yeah. it to me. Like yeah. Instead of turning left, I moved to the right. Yeah, good memory. And I think, do you know? Good memory. Yes. Excellent. Yeah. Yes. Okay, yeah. so we would like to do those bits that you just mentioned. That's yeah. all. Okay, so it was mainly because uh, we didn't check the mirrors and the signals there. So we did get yeah. another minor there for, for not using the signal. Okay, mm. so so far, I think that's four. Um, we got another signal that was a little bit late. So when we're exiting the roundabout, yeah. uh, before we start to change lanes, show the left signal. We kind of changed into the left lane, then showed the left thinking. signal. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So just a little bit late on that signal. There wasn't much traffic around. That's five. Uh, we've got six, seven, eight. So just a few more to go. We're driving a little bit slow. 20 miles an hour on one of the roads. It's a reasonably straight road. We could probably get 25. Um, blue car. I can't remember what it was, but it overtook. Yeah, it overtook. You remember? Yeah. Yep. So just marked mm -hmm. a minor for that. Uh, we did a left turn at the sign for Headstone Lane. And it's quite a sharp left turn. We got oversteer. So we steered over and then we almost went towards the pavement and then you steered back to the right. So it's just a little bit of a loss of control, what we call oversteer. Mm -hmm. uh, the final one now, so I think that's eight in total. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, lane discipline. Now, this was before the U-turn. So you know the little side road that we have before we go on the dual carriageway? It's kind of like a sandy color road. It's not black tarmac like this. It's mm. like where the houses are. Yeah. When we I drove know. onto that road, mm. do you remember we drove onto the right side and then we followed the right side of that sandy colored road towards the end. And as we got to the end, we came back over to the left. I'm not sure if we remember that or not. No. No? All right. So maybe we can look back at the video. You know, yeah. that's what it's there for. And um, that's it. So the pole is in and it's drum roll time. <laughs> <laughs> um, unfortunately, we've got 85%, 0.71 uh, of chat saying that it's mm -hmm. a fail. And now, chat are the judge during examiners. So they've cast their verdict. I apologize, you know chat quite harsh would i agree with them yes i would uh there was a few serious driver faults so we that bit that i was mentioning about positioning on the side could be so um serious so you know i said we positioned just now on the right mm -hmm. okay there was a vehicle coming could be serious let's just brush that one under the carpet because we can put that down as a minor so there's a couple of other ones so the signal when necessary so what actually happened is we were turning right on one of the roundabouts actually two of the roundabouts and we're not using the right signal so as we're going around the roundabout the cars that are waiting to join the roundabout Mm -hmm. they're not too sure which direction we're going to yeah, go. Home. So only because there's vehicles there and they wouldn't really know where we're going to go, we must use the signal. 
okay and then the last one do you remember to just touch the wheel a little yeah. bit move yeah. it across so just on that one straight road between the two roundabouts where we turn right mm. there's a little bit of curb i think it's near a pedestrian crossing if i remember correctly i'm not too yeah. sure yeah. and it just sticks out a little bit so we were just aiming for that so i just had to brush us off to the right just to avoid um, bumping into the curb that was sticking out okay any questions no no i got some kleenex in the back who'll we'll cut the cameras now we can have a little a little calm down time all right um overall drives quite nice yeah good memory as well so that's excellent like i said i'd never remember anything so as long as we remember that there's less chance of it happening on the real test and um, we've got a couple more mocks after this so if you guys like joining us everyone it's smiling <laughs> we'll see you on the next video until then goodbye bye bye